Hurricane Hunter aircraft crisscross hurricanes all the time to get vital information used to keep others safe. They're meant to go through some of the harshest conditions known, but there are places even these planes can't go. The point is to get them continuous observations where we currently do not have them, especially in the boundary layer, you know, the layer between ocean and atmosphere where aircraft cannot fly for extended periods of time because it's too low. This unmanned boat is a lot like a remote controlled toy, only much more sophisticated. It has equipment to measure things like air pressure, moisture, temperature, and wind speed, all in real time. It can also be controlled remotely or sent out on autopilot, keeping forecasters out of harm's way. Be able to get data in areas where you normally would not collect these measurements because they would put people at risk, for instance, flying too low with an aircraft, especially when you're trying to get in the eye of a, of a hurricane. Right now, NOAA has 10 of these unmanned boats. Full throttle. They'll test them this year and possibly begin putting them into hurricanes later this year or early next year. NOAA says they hope the unmanned craft will help them better understand how hurricanes behave, helping them create better forecasting models from the ground up or the water up. That's it, yeah.